What's going on guys? This is John with GameStreet1.com and this will be a review over an arcade game called Timber. It came out in 1984. It was published by Bally Midway in the arcades. It's been ported to a num number of other compilations since. Never really home ported though, I don't believe. What this game is, it's kind of a follow up to a really good game I really like. It's called Tapper, or later known as Rupert Tapper. And what Bally Midway decided to do was convert a lot of Tapper arcades to Timber arcades. I think the strong suit about Timber itself is the fact that you can play multiplayer co-op. So as you can see here, I'm only playing single player, but uh, this game can be played with two players simultaneously. And the object of the game is to chop down as many trees as you can. There's there's an X amount of number of trees you have to cut down within X amount of time limit. Obviously, as you go on in the game, time limit gets shorter, the number of trees go up. There's various things you gotta worry about. You have this bear throwing honeycombs at you or, or bee, bee combs at you and obviously that, that kills you or it takes away a life. Also, you have some trees will have a bird randomly inside the tree. And if you cut down the tree, you have to uh, worry about the, the, the bird coming after you. There are bonus stages in the game as well, uh, which is very similar to Tapper. The bonus stages are cool. You have to stay on a log and the object is how long you can stay on the log. The longer you stay on the log, the more points you accumulate. It's one of my favorite aspects of the game. I really like these bonus parts of Timber. The game does get progressively harder. Uh, you get more trees. In later stages, this is level three or four. I have 19 trees to chop down in a minute and a half. They randomly pop up. You have to worry about where the tree lands too because you have to worry about tripping over them, which can delay you. If you have an ax, you can use it to you as a weapon. You can hit the beehive thrown at you. You can hit the bird if it's chasing you if you're pointing in the right direction. One button will chop right. Another button will chop left. That does take a little bit getting used to. And you also have to worry about chopping when you chop down the tree, it not falling over on you, so you have to push over the right way. So there's some strategies as far as where the tree actually lands and falls. Let me know what you guys think of Timber. Let me know if you guys played it before. Appreciate you guys leaving a comment. Thanks for subscribing. We'll see you guys soon. Happy gaming. Take care.